Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And on the menu, live action from the Zweite Bundesliga. It's Hannover versus Heidenheim. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, the game plan of the coach is to get the ball into the front players as quickly as possible. He is the player to do it. He's brilliant with his back to goal. We'll link up the play, and he's key to the way they play the game. starting 11 for Hannover well when they don't have possession it will be a back five but when they win the ball back the wing backs will push further forward to make it a 3-5-2 let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors well it's a flat 4-5-1 which would suggest they're going to try and play on the counter attack however that will only work if they don't drop too deep and can't support the main striker. And so the battle commences. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Derek Kuhn. On the ball, Teuchert. Nicely saved. Played over. And a goal! 1-0! And what a fast start they've made to this game! Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So underway again here, one nil the score. Jan Schupner. Good tackle, it'll be a throw. Maloney. Will it be? They had to react and did. It's got to be! And a goal! An end-to-end -end game! And they weren't behind for long! Well, here it is again. And how many times have we seen this in recent games? Teams trying to play out from the back, not doing it particularly well, giving away sloppy possession and then getting punished. It's a really poor goal to concede. So back underway following the equaliser. And the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Well, they were very patient but they no longer have the ball. 
Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, it petered out. This looks promising. And looking towards the back post. Well, it was a poor attempt, and a goal kick it is. Giving the ball away. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And with that, they thwarted the opportunity. Denis Tomala. Jan Niklas Beste. Siersleben. Schüppner. Kleindienst. There didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision. an important intervention oh a lovely ball well, full marks for trying but very deftly cut out he succeeds in clearing it well he stopped them in their tracks This might be ideal for the counter. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Maloney. Difficult to stop him. Opportunity to take the lead. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well-balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. Well, 2 1 it is here. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. So that will be all for the first half here in Hannover. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, what a first half he had. I thought he was outstanding. He caused the defenders all sorts of problems with his movement and pace, and he fully deserved his two goals, and I expect more from him in the second half. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us.
missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Say Muroya. And cleared away. And players waiting in the centre. Well, he had the scent of a hat-trick in his nostrils, but not this time. Well, he keeps getting into good positions. He'll surely get another chance before the end of the game. How can he take them on and beat them? Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Can they hit on the break? Not a great challenge. Free kick here. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. An alert reaction to tip it over. This corner could be useful to them. Delivering it. And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, let's look at this again. It's a decent delivery into the box, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So underway again at two all. Max Vesushkov. They've given it away. Into the final twenty minutes. That's a well struck pass. He has time to play it over. Oh, that's a fine save. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. And space to cross it. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. 
Well, time is running out to get this winner, but the fans certainly believe it's coming. Just listen to the noise. What a fantastic finish we could have here. Will he finish? Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance, and the fans are laughing this up. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? They're showing a willingness to attack as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. Cross fired over. The clearance wasn't decisive. An attack full of promise. Just the challenge that was required. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Max Bezushkov. And Schaub on the ball. Options in the middle. Denis Tomala. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, what a good finish to the game that was. They just wore down the opposition, and in the end, they got their reward. That's a really good win for them. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.